question mark. Seems like a Zetter player to me. That's what I'm going with. How can he not hear you? I, I, I think it's just. I, I think it's just your microphone. Then, I I don't know what else to do then, because I have you maxed out on both Streamlabs and on Discord. Okay. And he will be back. And while that is happening, I will attempt to get the replays here. There's good. I I don't understand why it would sound like he's in a different room. Cause like I said, I I actually just got the volume max now on Streamlabs. Is that any better? Sometimes you gotta go with the iPhone 4 microphone, like, there's nothing you can do about it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is what it's like to be round and round as recess points. Too true. Too true. Okay. That's... is that even possible? I guess technically you can't drown in fools. I, I think I saw a DQ. Really? God damn Was not Zetterburn, I'm very sad. Yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah, we get the ups, ups, uh. Up strong there. God, I wish I could speak. It's kind of important for being a commentator. It's okay. I'll just I'll just talk about Fortnite or something. That's that's what rivals commentators do, right? <laughs> or Among Us. That's that's what that's what rivals commentators do, right? They just talk about Among Us. <laughs> I will say. I will say, after like patch four in that game, it kind of just went to the dogs. Cause like they they added the airplane, they added the airplanes. It was just all downhill from there. Do you remember when they used to hold majors and they would just introduce like a new game changing update like a day before the majors ran <laughs> to like advertise their games? Yes. Yes, that, and then they're all legal. <laughs> yeah. Honda Civic just comes in as the dark horse and wins the whole event. Right, I know. What could you even do? I think they, they have a different tag now. I don't know what their new tag is. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I thought Goose was bad. Hey, good job, Aichi. Good job. Taking game one. Yeah, nice. <laughs> yeah. That is dumb. It's like... So what, it just kills you at like 60 every time? That's awesome. <laughs> Wait, that's actually ridiculous. <laughs> I'm gonna start counting workshop wins as like actual tournament wins. Like just help just tell people you've beaten menace, but like don't specify. What? <laughs> that was... Uh yeah, I mean you only got yourself to blame on that one. Plus the fact that he was charging that down strong for like three years. Mm -hmm. Oh nice. Yeah. No, I mean, once you get momentum like that going, I think in this game it's really hard to come back from. Obviously it's doable, but it's just like the mental, you know. The season three or what? Oh, uh, I mean, I think I only had like 15 solo wins or something. I was like, okay. I, I usually played in squads. Okay. Yeah, I was not a, I was not a Fortnite prodigy. I just played it on the weekends sometimes. <laughs> No, I'm like early early Fortnite was a blast. Like before everyone became a billboard. Okay, Raster actually lives though. So they're one of the few characters that can get pineapple and still survive. So I've I've been seeing this a lot from Aichi. Yeah, I mean good stuff to Aichi, just completely in the control of the game, but I've been seeing a lot where they got like these up air setups. And they decide to go for up strong instead, but the up strong is like kind of slow, so it doesn't connect. I'm pretty sure if you just NATO there, you can just NATO them off the top. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure if you just NATO instead, you just kill them. Shirts from what? Okay. What I do know is that we're getting right into game three here. Aichi versus Arrow. Oh yeah, baby. Swag. <laughs> yeah. One of the things you always see in like these lower level brackets is uh like after every option you pick, you always parry immediately afterwards to counteract the dash attack that the other person's gonna do. Oh my god! No! They couldn't parry in time! They were mashing it. <laughs> okay, catching with the catching with the F strong there. Yeah, that one did not get parried. Ooh, F strong right across the stage. That was not good DI. No. Oh my god, it's happening again. It's happening again. We are, we are in the matrix. Okay. 
Yeah, I feel like they just need to throw it out every time they can. Like, even here. I mean, there they got Slipstream out, but... If, if... Raster should never be saving Slipstream unless, like, you know that you can combo out of it. So, like, I know, like, Blue does... I know, like, top-level Rasters do that, like, Blue and, uh... Like, uh... I think, like, Matty Ice, and I've seen Windows do it, too, where they, like, carry people off t up to the top and then use, like, Slipstream to extend the combo. But, like, I, I think at, like, lower levels, just throw the Slipstream out, man. Like, having, having the neutral advantage is just so powerful. Yeah. For... For a split second there, Aichi considered challenging the down strong. I saw it, and then he decided, nope, I'm just gonna wait for it to whiff and then punish. And then won the game won the game off that, so good decision. Alright, Aichi's gonna take that 3-0. Alright. Quick, fill dead space while I find the other replays. God, I love Rivals commentary. <laughs> oh, original among Yeah, I think when the game first came out, it was a blast. It just happened to be that after the fact, it became uh, internet poisoned. Yeah. Like, I think definitely when people started comparing real life objects to the crewmate, like that's that's when it got bad. <laughs> Did you remember, um, oh god, like, Fall Guys came out at the same time, and, like, they were, that was, like, the same, it was, like, in the same level of popularity, but Fall Guys just ended up dying so fast, comparatively. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you you can only play it for so long. At the end of the day, it's just it's Fall Guys. <laughs> oh, I, I bet people do. I mean, it's it's a pretty casual stream game. Like you don't really have to be that invested in it, and you can still make it far. 